Hello there. How are you? I hope all is well and everything is absolutely amazing on your end. Welcome back on my channel. You're listening to Light Channelings once again and I am back with a beautiful new card reading for all of you. So, let's get started with the reading without wasting any of our time. Again, what a wonderful reading to look at and such a beautiful uplifting powerful message this reading has for all of you the way things got presented to you in this connection in the past is what's happening with those who are the cause of the separation that you are either going through at the moment or were going through with your counterpart in the past. If you two are already reunited at the moment or are in contact back again. I cannot say that all of you are in contact or have reunited because that's not being shown here and definitely may not be happening. But yes, some of you are going to receive some sort of contact and communication coming from your counterpart. Expect it to come sooner than later, okay? Your connection ended in the past because your counterpart chose another connection over you. It could be the connection they have with their friends, with their family or just someone else they chose over you. Doesn't matter what it was. But it definitely was a karmic connection they chose over you and for that they may have even left you out into the cold, may have abandoned you, rejected you or just may have cheated on you, betrayed you, lied to you, broke your heart which gave you a lot of pain and you may have suffered for months, years going through and carrying that heartache and pain within your heart. Your counterpart chose that other connection or that other person over you for money, for fame, for fortune, for prestige, for status, because of all of their arrogance and pride. But at this point of time, they are losing it all, including all of those who were involved. If that other person came in between both of you on purpose, knowingly and intentionally, this person is going through the same kind of karmic changes you had to go through because of this person. This person is going through a living hell just like this person made you go through a living hell after destroying your connection or after causing this separation in between both of you or after making your counterpart cheat on you and betray you by breaking your heart. It looks like it was a woman. Now it could just be anyone in your case. It could be someone they share a family with. It could be their mother, their sister, their friend their girlfriend, their wife, their ex-wife or someone they chose over you after breaking up with you or after breaking your heart, okay? So at this point of time, this person is heartbroken, feels like this person is going crazy. This person is boiling from within with too much anger, hatred and some other negative emotions. Because this person has found out that you are going through something extremely positive in your life or things are looking up for you, you are doing very well in your life or you are about to experience and attract all of these blessings. The reason this person wanted to win over you, the reason this person wanted to put you down smack you down, knock you down so that this person could feel powerful and victorious but 
karma turned everything upside down for this individual instead of you this is something which is making this person extremely angry upset sad and depressed all at the same time it's not like this person doesn't realize his or her mistake it's not like this person doesn't know what he or she did to you this person as well as your counterpart knows very well what they had put you through and everything that's happening in their life is actually their own karma they are very well aware of that and both of them not just your counterpart this other person as well feels bad somewhere sorry and regretful not completely about the way they've treated you about their uh, toxic illicit relationship they created behind your back which broke your heart and ultimately destroyed your connection and caused the separation to happen in between both of you they know very well what they are going through is because of all of that your counterpart and this person did not care about what's right and what's wrong what would be the positive thing to do and what it is they should avoid they did not care about any of that in the past but now when they are having to pay the price for what they did to you now they are realizing and understanding that it was not the right and the best thing to do this person this lady feels extremely burdened at the moment this person is struggling with something maybe this person has a lot to do and deal with on top of that this person is not at all happy and is uh, having to face depression anxiety restlessness sleepless nights for some exactly the same way you had to in the past all because of their drama their negativity that they were either throwing at you or were projecting on to you now they are in the same position your counterpart failed in doing something very recently your counterpart did not find success in his or her endeavors or projects they were working on to and they'll not until and unless they show that they had a change of heart and attitude and make their wrongs right these things are not going to change until and unless they show a change in the real physical world there is a huge and profound transformation taking place in all of these people's lives including yours you are also transforming for the better and just like you these people are learning to transform themselves for the better but before they can make it they'll have to go through these changes that which they made you go through your connection is coming back into the picture once again this connection is having its own rebirth this connection is coming into balance once again this connection is the ultimate divine blessing in all of your lives actually not just into yours or your counterpart but this connection is actually transforming all of those people's lives as well who try to destroy it or deny it because they could not understand it or couldn't wrap their head around the fact that such spiritual soul connections powerful beyond their imagination or expectation even exist can exist and can survive the test of time they couldn't understand all of these things in the past but now universe is making them understand all of this now universe is teaching them and is also making them aware that universe doesn't have limitations you do there are no limitations and no boundaries to what universe can do and create things as small as your mind cannot comprehend exist 
things as big as you can never ever imagine exist in this divine vast universe everyone needs to remember and take note of these facts this is what these people are learning at the moment neither your counterpart nor the karmics are able to create anything positive in their life or are able to fulfill their dreams and wishes that which they had after destroying your connection or filling your life with unnecessary pain misery and suffering all because they were ignorant arrogant proud rigid stubborn and just many other more things like that we are not here to castigate or condemn them this reading is just bringing you the clarity and the guidance you need in order for you to take your next step forward on your journey and find peace in your heart about the fact that nothing is ever hidden from the universe and no one who has ever done you wrong intentionally on purpose or for seeking revenge would ever be able to escape from their consequences sometimes when the damage is irreversible and you cannot receive or get back what it is that you lost then universe has to balance the scales in some way shape or form and this is the way scales are being balanced behind the scenes for everyone to learn their lessons and get the taste of their own medicine appropriately you are moving forward and they are moving backwards because they didn't care to move forward in the past when they were presented with the opportunity and the chance to create a positive shift and a beautiful wonderful change in all of their lives they chose otherwise so now they are having to experience the same kind of changes and endings and painful events and occurrences you had to experience and all of this is karma you are advised to learn from these changes that are happening in your connection at the moment don't feel happy about their suffering and what they are going through don't feel like you won or anything of that sort you should focus on learning that this is the way universe works and for that reason you should always you must always keep your mind your heart as well as your tongue when you use it clean and pure this is what's needed this is what we all need to learn make sure that you do not hate these people make sure that you do not send any kind of negative or curseful energy towards them because that's not what you would want to receive back that's exactly what i'm trying to explain to all of you here okay just keep all of these things in your mind okay everything is at a standstill in these people's lives if your counterpart got married to someone else or if they gave commitment to another person over you that connection has came to a complete standstill and is not going to go anywhere from this point onwards because that connection is not meant to flourish prosper and bloom that connection is meant to come to an end because it was a karmic connection it was a toxic connection it came into your counterpart's life for them to learn some lessons and clear their karma which i feel like they have cleared to some extent or if there is anything even left it's on the verge of ending and getting cleared away your connection is meant to come into union your connection is meant to bloom and blossom your connection is divinely guided supported and protected your connection is going to come into balance and its life once again 
This is the divine will and ultimate divine judgment universe has given here in the favor of your divine spiritual soul connection. Even if it had an ending in the past because your counterpart chose a karmic connection over you, it's going to come back to its original form. It's going to resurrect back from its ashes. Even if you do not want it to, even if you may want to just move on, even if you may not want to return back to your counterpart or may not be interested in taking them back, for this reading specifically, it is being shown that it still is going to come into union and is going to flourish. Some way, shape or form, this resentment that you're still carrying inside your heart or this disinterest that you've developed for this connection or towards your counterpart is just going to get removed or fade away. This may happen unexpectedly or if you show your stubbornness in any way then I feel like some kind of uh, unexpected change is also going to happen or come into your life which is going to again make you reconsider your priorities or may help you look within deep down in your heart once again so that you can let go of this past negative energy or the remnants from the past that you might be carrying around within your heart which are causing you to either become detached from your counterpart not detached in a positive way but in more so like I don't care about you something like that I don't care about this connection we all usually suggest that the feminine counterpart should remain detached but this detachment that I'm talking about is not the kind of detachment universe wanted from her this detachment is coming from the past negative energy that she has been holding on to which is making her feel like something else is better or someone else would be better than being with her counterpart it's not like that divine is going to force her to come into union with her counterpart it's more so about making her connect with her real true self and her real true feelings and emotions that she carries deep down within her heart universe is just saying that you'll find the clarity you need you'll find the balance you need and require so that you can let go of the past and move forward from this negativity or this apathy that you may create in your heart towards your counterpart or others or just this connection okay that's what i wanted to say so just know that things are working well things are looking good here everything is working out in the favor of this divine spiritual soul connection of yours your counterpart and this other person as well who was in the picture and may have hurt you more than anyone even more than your counterpart is also in a lot of pain at the moment i mean all of them are going through everything they need to go through and deserve to go through so that they can come out into the light if they choose to which is going to happen because your counterpart have started to show the signs of progress and transformation here in the past they left you for negative reasons but at the moment they are learning from your example in the past your counterpart was running behind a materialistic superficial life they wanted to live just because they wanted to show off and please other people they were following a lifestyle of pomp and show but now at the moment they are taking inspiration from you and are learning from your example to focus on growing and glowing from within. They found that clarity that it's not about what you show off and what you put on your face in order to look beautiful. 
it's more so about how beautiful you feel from inside and how can you radiate that inner beauty outwards they are learning that they are learning that from your example in the past they walked away from you to either run behind fame and fortune but now they want to attract you back by going within and working on themselves developing and working on their own inner charisma their confidence their inner balance finding themselves from deep within now they are working on that i don't see that happening with this lady at this point of time because she is still being very very bitter about the changes that she is going through she may take some time to learn her lessons at this point of time she is just complaining and blaming and you know cursing abusing spreading negativity because she is in pain somewhere she might be blaming your counterpart or she might be blaming you because she may think that you are the third party in their connection or things like that it's not true actually it's just true in her own head which she believes to be true but it's not true she was the third person which needed to be removed and that's happening through way of divine intervention here but she's not happy about that it'll take some time for her to come to her senses or wrap her head around this fact and accept this truth that she was being the devil in someone else's life it's not like she's the only person to be blamed for your counterpart is equally responsible and must be held accountable for the damage they have created to your spiritual soul connection as well as your life but above all these were some tests challenges and obstacles all of you had to go through and depending on the actions choices and decisions all of you took while facing these challenges these obstacles and tests you are either going to get rewarded for all of that or pay the price for and that's what's happening at this point of time as well okay these changes that these people are going through are the result of their unwise choices and decisions and the prosperity and the abundance that you are flourishing with and radiating outwards is the result of your good deeds and the positive energy you sent out into the universe so everyone is now reaping what they've sown and it's because your counterpart can see you growing glowing and evolving they are learning from your example because when they gave attention to wrong people and their wrong advices they had to face and experience failures till this date or in the recent past but now they want to change that they are being guided to change all of that and they are paying attention if they are not paying any attention to all of these things just yet know that they will they'll start to very very soon and soon is different for each and every one of you so do not obsess about how soon and how later focus on yourself continue to focus on your own life and surrender all of your worries because the justice is getting served here in your favor and always will in the favor of this divine spiritual soul connection of yours okay so just know that the karmic connection is ending may have already ended or will end very very soon your connection is going to come back into the picture once again and you'll have a wonderful new beginning with your counterpart for some even if you do not feel like you want it it still is going to happen if it's written for you or if it's meant to be for others universe is going to tell you what it is that you need to do okay so don't obsess about your future and don't worry about it because it's going to be good and wonderful for all of you if you remain true to yourself and your path spiritual path i'm talking about let go of all of your worries and pray for these people because they are in pain a lot of actually 
they are in a lot of pain they are going through a lot pray for them pray for their healings and them blessings wish them well and continue to move forward because that will help them learn their lessons and move forward and end these toxic negative karmic cycles and patterns once and for all so this was your reading i hope you enjoyed listening to me and this brought you great sense of clarity if so kindly share your thoughts and your experiences in the comment section below feel free to hit the like button and subscribe this channel for more such amazing content to be readily available for all of you on a regular basis that's all for now i'll be back again till that time please take care of yourself and your loved ones bye bye